DJI Mavic 3 Cine First Use Guideline. In this video, we will show you how to use DJI Mavic 3 Cine for the first time. Unboxing. Open the box and remove DJI Mavic 3 Cine and its accessories. Remote Controller First Use The built-in battery of the remote controller is set to sleep mode by default. Before using, connect the remote controller and charger via USB-C cable for approximately one minute to activate the battery. Activating the DJI RC Pro. Press and then press again and hold for approximately two seconds to power on the remote controller Select a language after powering on the remote controller. Connect the remote controller to the internet via Wi-Fi. After connecting, tap Next to continue and select the time zone, date, and time. Log in with your DJI account if you already have one. For new users, please register before logging in. After successfully logging in, an activation prompt will appear on the screen. Tap to activate. Successful activation will result in a notice on the screen. After launching the DJI Fly app, you can either swipe left or right to return to the home screen. Preparing the aircraft. Remove the storage cover and unfold the drone's arms. Powering on, off. When using the battery for the first time, connect the USB-C port at the rear of the aircraft directly to the battery charger until the battery indicators are on, indicating the battery is successfully activated. If the battery level is at or below approximately 50%, we suggest charging it up to 75% or above first in order to ensure enough power for activation and firmware updating. Press once and then again and hold for about two seconds to power on the aircraft. To power off the aircraft, press the power button and then press again and hold for approximately two seconds. Activating and updating. Open the DJI Fly app and log in with your DJI account and password. Follow the app's instructions to finish the activation process. The prompt will appear on the top left of the screen if a firmware update is available. Tap it to enter the update screen and tap Start Update to update the aircraft and remote controller to the latest firmware version at the same time. During the update, do not power off the device or exit the app. After the update is finished, both the aircraft and the remote controller will remain powered on. Storage. Fold the aircraft arms. Attach the storage cover. And store the aircraft in the convertible carrying bag. You can also unfold the convertible carrying bag into a backpack which provides more space if needed. Preparing for flight. Remove the storage cover. Unfold the arm. and securely install the propellers. Check the battery level of the Intelligent Flight Battery. Remove the control sticks from the storage slots at the bottom of the controller. Mount both control sticks and unfold the antennas. Open the DJI Fly app to enter the flight interface. 
tap safety, said obstacle avoidance action to bypass or break, said the RTH height higher than the tallest building or nearby object. Flying basics. Before flying, choose an open, obstacle-free area and place the aircraft on level ground with the rear facing you. Power on the aircraft. Check the battery level of the remote controller, power it on, and set the RC mode to normal. Check the responsiveness of the control sticks first. Calibrate the control sticks in the DJI Fly app if you are prompted to. Check the flight interface in the app. Confirm that there are no abnormal reminders and the GPS signal is good. Tap the takeoff icon on the left and press and hold the prompt icon to enable auto takeoff. After takeoff, the icon will change to auto landing. Tap the auto landing icon on the left and hold. Then the aircraft will automatically land. To take off manually, using mode two as an example, Pull both sticks all the way to the bottom of the controller and then push inwards or outwards. When the propellers start to rotate, gently push the left control stick up to manually take off. The left control stick is used for adjusting the aircraft's altitude and orientation. The right control stick controls the aircraft to move forward, backward, and to the left and right. After you start the motors, if the aircraft has not taken off, push down the left control stick to stop the motors. If the aircraft has taken off, push down the left stick to land. Press the flight pause and RTH button on the remote controller to make the aircraft break. You can view flight distance and speed information at the bottom left corner of the screen. During flight, Keep the RC antennas facing the drone during flight for optimal transmission. When the GPS signal is weak, the compass encounters interference, or lighting is not sufficient for visual positioning, the aircraft will enter attitude mode and cannot hover or auto brake. To avoid accidents, please land in a safe location as soon as possible. Taking photos and videos, locate the button on the top right of the remote controller. Press halfway to activate autofocus and press all the way down once to take a photo. The record button is located in the top left corner of the remote controller. Press to start recording and press again to stop. You can also adjust the gimbal pitch and control the camera by using the gimbal dial on the left side. You can use the dial on the right to adjust camera zoom or enter the camera parameter setting in the DJI Fly app to adjust other camera parameters. Tap the playback icon on the bottom right to view and download your footage shot on DJI Mavic 3 Cine. Advanced RTH. Tap the RTH button on the left side of the screen and hold, or press the RTH button on the remote controller and hold to initiate RTH. As long as lighting is sufficient for the visual sensing system to operate, Advanced RTH will be automatically activated and the aircraft will plan and execute the optimal flight route back to the home point. Safety Precautions Before takeoff, check if the flight environment meets all requirements and set the RTH altitude. Don't forget to check if the propellers and battery have all been installed securely. After powering off the remote control, don't forget to remove the control sticks and put them back into the storage slots. Please note that the obstacle sensing system does not work in low light environments or during night flight. Always fly safely. Attaching the propellers. DJI Mavic 3 Cine has two different types of motors, A, B, and propellers, A, B, that pair up. Match the A propellers with the gray circle markings to the A motors with gray markings. Likewise, the B motors without the gray circle markings should go with B propellers without gray markings. Match the propellers to the motors. Press the propellers down firmly and rotate the lock direction. Remember to check that everything is firmly attached to ensure a safe flight. Thank you for watching our DJI Mavic 3 City Tutorial First Use Guidelines. 
Enjoy your flight.